10 times on the out. It's like an eight minute song. That was Like a Hurricane by Neil Young, continuing the Neil Young tribute for his courage to standing up to Spotify in the name of censorship. He's on the right side of history because the Bo Jiden administration is also setting their sights on silencing Joe Rogan. Danger. The truth is danger. Anyhow. That was written in 1975, and it came out on the 1977 album, American Stars and Bars. Neil wrote it with his buddy Taylor Phelps, a uh, neighbor of his in La Honda, California, which is in San Mateo County, between Santa Cruz Mountains and the Santa Clara Valley, uh, in the backseat of a DeSoto Suburban. So a DeSoto Suburban, if you aren't aware, is like, just think of your typical 1950s car, you know, with the, the big sort of billowing rounded forms of the of the wheel wells and it's got sort of one of those things coming out the front and uh, apparently had eight seats in it it was a four-door but there were eight seats they had something called jump seats which i guess were extremely dangerous um i guess getting rear-ended you know <laughs> sorry kids um and when he was writing this, Neil and uh, his buddy Taylor, in the backseat of a DeSoto Suburban suspect, um, Young was unable to sing at the time because of uh, vocal cord surgery. And uh, Neil, man, he's got problems. And the last song we did, which was um, yesterday, and it was called uh, another Ye the Neil Young song called, uh, oh, I can't remember right now what it was. Mm. Um, he uh, wrote it on acoustic guitar because he could he had back surgery or a back problem and he couldn't stand up but he could just sit down and play acoustic guitar and He seems to have been plagued with certain injuries throughout his career, but anyhow, I guess that's uh, par for the course in life. 
And um, he said that the melody was inspired by Del Shannon's Runaway from 1961. You know that song? I just listened to it, so that's how I know it. It's, um, the, and I wonder, I, why, 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 I wonder. Oh, my little runaway, run, 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 run away. And so maybe that'll be tomorrow's song. What do you think? Put it in the comments. Would you rather me do Del Shannon's Runaway, where um, Neil basically lifted the melody from? Or should I attempt the scorpions like a hurricane? Mm. So, what's in the news? Well, France has, the People's Republic of France has closed their borders to people who have declined to be injected once again with the wonderful experimental gene therapy. So, I'm just asking myself, it seems like all these Western leaders, uh, normally the, 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 the paradigm, the paramount, the uh, pinnacle of freedom, are t are, it seems like they're actively trying to destroy their nations. You know, you've got Princess Justine in Canada goes into hiding because uh, the people are fed up. And uh, who else? Oh, you've got that crazy bitch down in uh, New Zealand. Yacinda, Hacinda, whatever. She, her name, you don't know how to say it. It's like uh, Ghislaine Maxwell, you know. They're kind of they've got the same set of morals, if you think about it. But, man, that, that bitch is crazy. And uh, Australia, meanwhile... You've got countries opening up, and other countries, the more communist-inclined countries, like the People's Republic of France, tightening things down. So, I did hear in the news today that one of the fucking piece-of-shit, retarded um, ministers of the People's Republic of France says that he's, uh, he's guessing that the um, Vichy Pass is going to be lifted um, before summer. Because, that's what they do every year, is they open up the summer because that's when they get all their tourist money. But... I'm calling for a boycott of the People's Republic of France. You'll thank me. Like, I, I, I paraphrase uh, Camilla, the uh, Vice President of the United States of uh, Chaos. Do not come. Do not come. Anyhow, there's so many of you uh, there watching today. Why don't you... Uh, if you have a question, also, I'd like uh, you to vote on whether I should do the Scorpions or Del Shannon. Aujourd'hui, j'ai rentré dans euh, le poste et oh, salut le Kekana, dis bonjour si vous voulez. Et je suis désolé parce qu'il y a une petite euh, décalage entre le, le vidéo et le commentaire. Ça fait euh, plus ou moins 30, 40 secondes. Donc si vous écrivez quelque chose maintenant ou si vous mettez un petit pouce, euh, um, ça, ça, il faut 40 secondes euh, que je le vois ici. Ok, donc aujourd'hui j'étais en train d'expliquer que je rentrais dans euh, un picard, la poste et molop sans un couche de visage aujourd'hui. Ok, et je vous conseille de faire la même chose, d'accord, parce qu'il est à nous de répondre nos droits, d'accord, le gouvernement criminel ne veut pas ça. Vous avez entendu euh, le président de euh, Manuel Macron, ouais? Il a dit spécifiquement, explicitement, qu'il voulait punir les gens qui ne voulaient pas participer dans cet expériment euh, vaccinal. Soit dit vaccinal, c'est pas un vaccin, c'est euh, le thérapie génique euh, expérimental. 
tout simplement ça. Donc, euh, je vous conseille de faire tomber le masque, le mascarade, le théâtre, c'est fini. Il est à nous de reprendre, de reprendre nos droits, d'accord Quotidiennement, chaque jour. Il faut du courage, mais c'est tout à fait possible. D'accord Je vous aime. Euh, bonne belle soirée. À demain. And six simple turns. Ciao for now.